That concert, which benefits UNA's band program, is a little different than past concerts. Dr. Jimmy Simpson says there will be more variety in tomorrow night's show, plus guest artists will be performing some popular Broadway tunes. Both Simpson and Dr. Ed Jones agree that the big band has a very large following here in the Shoals. This annual benefit program helps to enhance UNA's budgeted scholarships. Well, the proceeds from the concert go directly to the UNA band program, and we will, it will afford us the opportunity to award six to eight students uh, partial scholarships to come to UNA. And how much money does it take to, uh, to award those six to eight scholarships? Well, if we make uh, around three or four four thousand dollars on the on the concert uh, we make it even um, get ten people in here on that amount of money as you know with the schools being in proration and so forth uh, we, we all need money to compete with other universities as far as band scholarships and so this is an enhancement type of fund for us well tomorrow night we'll be uh, featuring songs from Broadway shows and movies and uh, we'll be bringing in quite a few different people. Before we've had maybe one uh, different act, you might say, with the uh, jazz band, but this time we'll have several different groups coming in. We'll have a barbershop quartet coming in, I think, from Birmingham, and we'll uh, feature some of our local talent. Robert Allen Holder will be uh, singing, and Jack Bishop will be uh, singing, and also uh, Louis Fawcett. So um, it, it, it looks like it'll be a very entertaining program for the public, in addition to what the big band will be performing. Ought to be a good show. We